everyone, it's Tammy and it is Saturday morning and I am doing some errands. Ooh, that sun is coming through. Looks like I have a halo because I'm such an angel. <laughs> yeah, right. Um, but anyway, uh, I have to do some errands. I need to return a game to GameStop. I need to, because I got the wrong one, I think I might have told you guys that, but I got my son an Xbox for Christmas and um, he really wanted the game Y2K or something, NBA 2K 18. And um, so I got it for him. PlayStation version. <laughs> Returning that, hopefully they will ex even exchange it for the other one because I got it on Black Friday where it was really cheap. So I'm gonna do that. I need to go to Walgreens. I've heard that they had some really good stocking stuffers, so I want to get some of those. Um, I need to go to Walgreens to pick up a prescription for Katie and Alex, and maybe even me. I don't know if I have one there or not. Um, I need to. I don't need to. I'm going to go to Hobby Lobby and look and see what they have on sale right now. Um, and it seems like there was somewhere else I wanted to stop. Starbucks, I'm gonna get myself a coffee because I think that um, I haven't, I know that my person has put in for my surgery, so I'm hoping that I will have surgery on the 29th of this month. It's not positive, but I know I won't be able to enjoy Starbucks or anything like that in the very near future, even if it's not the 29th, it might be like the week after that or something. So I am going to partake in some extra fun stuff while I can, and that's okay. I'm not going to kick myself at all for that. So, um, I'll, and I'll still be reasonable about it, but um, I'm gonna get myself a Starbucks today. And later I have to go to Taylor, and I don't know if I'm gonna be vlogging any then or not. I'm hoping to actually, um, I'm getting an early start, so I'm hoping that I can go home and do a MAC makeup thing for you guys. I don't know if I'll get that done or not, because I need to take a shower um, and take off what I have on and redo it, but I wanted to take a shower because I want to color my hair. So <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to get all of that done. I might have to wait for that part until Sunday, but um, I have a few hours, um, yeah, a few hours to kill before I leave for Taylor. So I don't know if I am going to be able to do all of that or not. We'll see how it works out. No biggie either way. Um, but I like having some time to myself this morning. I'm hoping it's not too, too crazy, especially at Best Buy where I have to go to return the game. So I have to go to Best Buy, Walgreens, the Dollar Tree, Starbucks. I think that's it. And the Dollar Tree, I just want to kind of look around and see what kind of things they have and if there's anything that I need. Um, I don't have anything in particular in my head that I need to get. Just everything. <laughs> Nothing but everything. Uh, so yeah, that's what my plan is this morning. I have on my new Fab Fit Fun little scarf thing. It is freezing. It's 21 degrees. My hands are freezing cold. I need to knit myself some fingerless gloves. I think I actually have a pair in my car. I think I do. I should look and see. Um, know my middle console has an extra one of my phone holders for the windshield actually I think it has two extras yeah, here's one extra so it's because I know that oh, I think I feel some oh no that's my little hedgehog cleaner <laughs> isn't that funny um, so I don't know I got oh it does have gloves this isn't fingerless gloves. These are finger gloves. Oh, here's my fingerless ones. I thought I had some. These have fur inside. Ooh, they're very soft. So let's see, which ones can I grab two of? Gosh, what's this? I have sunglasses in here. These are, there's my flowery sunglasses. I had no idea where those had gotten off to. I'd been wearing these and I don't like them as much. These are, um, but those are expensive ones that I got for 
Huh, that's funny. Um, I got those from work for having been there for a while. I'll just wear these. Yay, hooray, I got some gloves. That will help my hands tremendously. And I have an air freshener in here. I'd like to look and see if they have any air fresheners, maybe at the Dollar Tree, that I can get for my kids for their cars. Just stocking stuffery things like that that will make me happy. And then I need to um, pay bills too, so that's no fun. So I don't want to spend all my moolah. <laughs> I actually ordered groceries too and have to pick those up later. Um, so these are nice and cozy. I'd forgotten about these. I think I got these at Target last year. So yeah, that's what I'm up to today. What are you guys doing today? I might take you along for some of it if I feel like it. I am really trying harder to vlog more frequently and in more places. I'm just not the best at it yet. I'd really like to find some inexpensive bath bombs. I really like bath bombs, but my goodness, I don't want to spend the lush prices on them, even though I know that they're fantastic. But honestly, I don't know. I'm just kind of weird. I can't, I can't really tell the difference between a lush one and just another one. I've even thought about making them because they seem so crazily, outrageously priced at lush. So I don't know, maybe I'm missing something. Maybe there's something special with them that I'm just not seeing. I know that some of them really make my skin feel soft, which is fabulous, but I can't say that the other ones don't. And um, the Lush ones are so colored with uh, coloring sometimes that they leave a ring in my bathtub and I don't like that. I have to wash my bathtub before I get out. Um, ain't nobody got time for that. So I don't know. Um, I love the Lush stuff and I love the stuff on Etsy, but I hate it too because I feel like, and I know that this is a ridiculous way to feel, like I can make that and I know I can, but that means I'd have to buy all the stuff and that means I'd have to make it. And you know, I'm a crafter, so I get that people have to charge for their craft. I totally get that. And I don't mind ordering some stuff on Etsy. I really wish I would have thought of it earlier because now it's almost too late to make sure that I would get it in time for Christmas. It might still be uh, reasonable. I think today's the 8th, maybe the 9th, I don't even remember, but um, it's, it's pushing it. And if I can find some at the Dollar Tree or at Walgreens for a buck or two, I'm going to do that instead. So that's what I'm going to do. And I know that Walgreens had some really cute ones earlier because I saw someone haul some. So that's where I'm kind of going, oh, some that smelled like sugar cookie, it said. Now that is the thing. Lushes do smell amazing. And some of the ones on Etsy smell amazing. I can't say I'm disappointed in any of them, quite frankly. The ones that I have hauled on Etsy, and especially the ones that I've told you guys about, and especially the ones that, because I tell you guys about things even if I haven't tried them yet, but the ones that I have repurchased from Etsy, because there are a couple shops that I've done that on, I don't remember off the top of my head what they are, but um, I think one of them was called My Soap Shop or something. But the ones that I have made repurchases from on Etsy have been phenomenal. and. I'm super thrilled with them. So, yeah. Maybe I'll just go back and order from them. Because I know that they had some muscle ones, like uh, muscle tension relief or whatever. I don't know if I'm saying that right. but um, And that's what I want to get some for my husband. I, I actually bought him some muscle soak and stuff like that because he gets tense muscles and um, I'm even thinking of getting those massages and getting like a gift certificate and putting it in his stocking too. So I'll see about that. I'll, if I do that, it will be probably with my next paycheck. So in a couple of weeks, like right before Christmas, I think that's like right before Christmas. That's like the 23rd or something, 22nd, maybe 22nd, 23rd, 24th. Yeah, it's the 22nd. <sighs> that's a hard day. That's the day my dad passed away. I don't know. <sighs> 
so that's a yucky day, but um, it's a yucky day for me. I guess it's a good day for my dad. He he got to go see Jesus that day, didn't he? I need to think positively about stuff like that. There's a TJ Maxx over here too. Oh, I really don't need anything though. And there's a Home Goods. They just have such cute stuff sometimes. Maybe I'll go to Walgreens and see if they have what I want. And if they don't, maybe I'll make a trip over to TJ Maxx. We'll see. I really don't want to be out all day. Well, I can't be out all day. Oh, did I just miss the turn-in? That's funny. Oh, no, it's up here. <laughs> I thought I missed where I could turn in for Best Buy. I'm trying to get a really early start. I don't know what time they open, but they don't look very busy yet. Hopefully, they're open now. I'm going sideways through the parking lot. I hate it when people do this, and here I am doing it. I don't normally do that. I'm just kind of excited. Okay, so it looks like they are open. Somebody, oh, no, they're not. Oh, goodness, he just went in the exit door. No wonder they're not busy. Goodness gracious, they don't open until 10 o'clock. Well, what time do these other stores open? 10 o'clock? That's ridiculous. Oh my goodness, there's a big old dog. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. Um, Party City, Shoe Carnival. I don't need that. What's this one? You can't read that. I have no idea when they open. Looks like TJ Maxx might be open. Okay, I think I'll go in here and see what I can see and kind of kill some time until Best Buy opens and then go in there and return that at least. I don't know if I'll get to have time to do everything that I wanted to do, but we'll see. Oh goodness, this spot is tight. Wah. All right, whew, made it. All right, I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye. I don't know if I can turn this off with my glove. We'll see. <laughs> nope. So I am on my way home now and I got my video game exchanged and then I also picked up the prescriptions for my son and daughter and I did not get a chance to go to Hobby Lobby or to the Dollar Tree. I may still have to do that. But I did spend almost $200 at the Dagon Walgreens period. But they had some really good stuff, some good stocking stuffers. And I know that there was something kind of big that, oh, I bought a little make, not a little, a makeup kit for Katie that I will show you guys um, in a vlog or in a haul video or something. So be on the lookout for that if you're interested. It's really cute. It's kind of a 3D thing. I don't know. I've never seen anything like it. Well, maybe I have, but I don't remember seeing anything like it. Um, and I think I am done Christmas shopping. I got all my stocking stuffers and I think I'm done. So I will show you guys some of that stuff and it should hopefully be fun. You guys will, I don't know, stocking stuffers are sometimes hard for me. So I will show you guys what I have. Now there are probably a couple gift cards that I still want to get, but I will probably wait until I get paid this next time before I get those just because I don't want to take all of my budget money out of this check. Otherwise I'll have no money for myself to, you know, live on for the next couple of weeks. So, um, you know, I, I'll pay the bills and all of that first, of course, but if I, you know, Feel like there's money that I can still use I'll probably pick up a couple gift cards but if not I'll just wait for the next time there's still a few things that I know that I'd like to get for Dennis um, one being a really big gift that he has asked for and he knows he's going to get it well he doesn't know but I probably won't even purchase that I'll probably just give him a picture of it so that he can get exactly what he wants because 
you know, if it's a $600 tool chest and if I'm going to spend that kind of money, I want him to have the one that he wants and not the one I think it is that he wants. So, um, I'll probably do that. So yeah, that's where I'm at with things. Other than that, life is good. I went to Qdoba, I picked myself up some chicken tortilla soup. I'm going to um, eat that when I get home and then head out to Taylor and um, visit with the kids and give David his Christmas present and I don't know that I'll vlog any of that but maybe I will I don't know that you've seen David in any of my vlogs um, Katie is definitely Twitter pated with this kid so and he is a good kid I cannot fault him um, he makes some silly mistakes sometimes or some goofball things, but um, my kids do too. I mean, it's not like, I mean, he's, he's just 20 and, you know, they're still young and dumb. <laughs> so, you know, my son has made some poor choices and he has made some poor choices and we'll get there, I hope. <laughs> If we'll get there one way or another, that's for sure. Um, but he is a great kid. Katie is just adores him. And I am very pleased with her choices in boyfriends so far. Um, really, she's had, she's picked some good ones her whole life. She has. Um, and all of the guys that she has chosen to spend some time with have been stand up guys and I'm proud of her for that and I feel like uh, David is no exception for sure he's a good kid and uh, I love him he's great so I'm happy that she's happy and he is so sweet to her I absolutely adore that that of course makes me happy too and um, so I'm excited to give him his present he hasn't seen a lot of like the older movies like he hasn't seen Napoleon Dynamite or uh, Stand By Me or The Goonies and um, or Charlie Brown he hasn't even seen all of the Charlie Browns <sighs> so I got him a bunch of movies and um, I think I may have done I don't know a video on that I'm not sure if I did or not but anyway um, maybe I'll do a video of him unwrapping or something I'm not sure it kind of depends on them too I never want to videotape them if they don't want to so uh, yeah, that's where I'm at with all of that and I'm excited to see them and it's just going to be for a minute because they have finals um, next week So, and then Katie comes home on Friday and I may stop at Whole Foods on the way there. I forgot because she loves brownies and um, my friend Tracy, hi Tracy, told me that they have vegan brownies at Whole Foods and that would be awesome to find some there because I've purchased some from Etsy for her and she's loved them and that's great but it takes a while to get there and they're very expensive and you know I don't know who's making them or anything not that you know that's okay I don't know who's making the ones at Whole Foods either so you know I can only hope and trust that they are what they say they are but um I might make one quick detour there if I have time. I really need to rush. So I will talk with you guys soon. And I'm pulling into my neighborhood. So yay. I'm excited that I get some soup. <laughs> it smells so good in my car. Um, I'll talk to you soon. Bye.